Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. In today's video, I am going to discuss about the error 0x8000003. A breakpoint has been reached. If you got that error, this is the video for you to help you resolve it. There is a couple of solutions which you can apply for this error. So now let's get started and I will guide you how to resolve this error step by step. The first solution, go to the search toolbar and type CMD. Command prompt will appear, click on run as administrator and here type sfc space slash scan now, enter. Once this is completed, restart your PC and check if this error has been resolved. This is the first solution. Now, if this solution did not work for you, close the command prompt, press windows key and R and then type ms config and then click on OK. Here go to services, then check hide all Microsoft services, click on that. So all Microsoft services has been hidden and now click on disable all, then click on apply and then OK. Now restart your PC and check if this error is resolved or not. Now if this error is not resolved, uh, what you need to do, go again and uh, type uh, Windows key plus R and here type mdsched.exe then click on ok and here click on restart now and check for problems click on that once you restarted your pc check if this error has been resolved if in case the error has not yet been resolved we can now go ahead and apply solution number four for that you can go to the search toolbar click on it and type cmd Command prompt will appear, click on run as administrator. And here you need to uh, type the following command, which is chk dsk space slash r. This is check this command. Uh, you need to know that that will take a couple of hours to be completed, especially if your disk is above one terabyte. So uh, you need to know that it will take a lot of time. Uh, several hours it can go up to seven hours so uh, uh, once uh, the check disk is completed then you check if this error has been resolved if again the error has not been resolved last solution which uh, uh, I recommend is to go to the search toolbar and type control panel control panel will appear click on it here view by put large icon click on program and features and here you need to locate Citrix workspace app double click on it and click on uninstall I don't have it here but uh, if you have it double click on it and then click on uninstall uh, once you uninstall it uh, minimize this page and then go to your uh, search engine, let's say Google Chrome, uh, and type Citrix Workspace Download. And then you will see here download Citrix Workspace app for Windows. And you will see that it is uh, the website of Citrix. Click on it. And here you can click on download for Windows and follow on with the steps until the download is completed. Once this is done, check if this error is resolved or not. With that, I have come to the end of this video. Thank you for watching. I hope this error has been resolved. Let me know in the comment section and don't forget to subscribe to my channel to watch upcoming videos. Take care. Goodbye.